Hi guys, what is up and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be crafting mobs. Yes, we are going to be building our own mobs out of random other mob body parts. Just like my cow, chicken, witch, zombie hybrid creation over there. Look at him. Look how bizarre he is. Dum, da, da, dum, da, da, dum, dum, dum. He's terrifyingly weird. So if you guys want to know how to make these super sick weird combinations, make sure to stick around for the whole video. So let's crack on with it. So, as I was saying, guys, we are going to be running you through how to craft these crazy weird mobs like this guy. Yeah, he's a weird dude. Uh, and I've got all the stuff laid out in the chest here. But before we get into that, uh, we are at the house near the Accolade Arena over there in the distance. Uh, we have the board with your guys' suggestions over there. And I'm thinking of bringing another one and putting it like about here-ish or maybe this side. I don't know. Yeah, but that's going to be for your guys' mod showcase suggestions. So if you want shout outs and things like that for mod showcases, and you, you're dying to see me do a mod showcase for you specifically, uh, yeah, remember, like, subscribe, notification bell, and then comment down below, and your comment will be brought up, and we will be doing your mod showcase suggestions. So I'm trying to get a bit more interactive with you guys, so you guys get to feel you're a bit more part of the channel because you guys are the main aspect to be honest but now we've got that sorted uh let's crack on with the main episode of crafting the evil stuff so this is actually the necromancy mod and uh we're gonna be going through how to do all of it we're gonna be i'm gonna be showing you how to craft so it utilizes needles a lot and that is crafted simply with bone meal like that also uses glass bottles you know what that is and it uses these scythes as well, which are fairly easy to craft. They're not too hard. Uh, also uses gore, a uh, jar of blood quite a lot. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to be showing you how to get all that stuff. So let's get out these. Let's get out a glass bottle. Let's get out some scythes. So we're going to spawn in a cow to do this. Uh, let's change on game mode. There we go. Uh, all right, so we got our needle. And we got our glass bottles so supposedly you just have to click yep yeah, there you go we've got one jar of blood we've got a jar of blood so we're gonna pop that up there and you can just keep doing that with these cows and filling up the jars of the blood you just gotta let you hit these dudes and how many jars seven jars now sick we're gonna need this lever as well and these mobs are dropping uh, extra body parts like lungs uh, and they drop muscle fiber stuff, which we will need later on But that's how you get all these other weird fancy body parts if you're wondering for later So we also need to get some souls So we need to craft the souls because they are what make up the mobs So we'll get some of this boom 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 ba boom ba boom So if you can see at the bottom here, we have soul in a jar So we've got jar o blood. We've got soul in a jar so that is giving us all that sick stuff. What'd you, what'd you say, bro? Okay, yeah, you stay there, because otherwise you are gonna get in the way of everything. Okay, let's pop, uh, let's move that up there, move that up there, yeah. All right, so next up, you're gonna wanna build, uh, well, I'll, I might as well show you. It's the crafting station, essentially, for all of it. You're gonna need one of these, you're gonna need these. Uh, that is gonna come in handy later, so we'll get that out for now. Uh, i tell you what, we'll do it here. Here is a good shout. So we'll go for that, that, and that. And then you've got to right click with the book to build this. And then this is where you're going to be putting all the different body parts. You're going to be putting the jar of blood there. You're going to be putting the souls over there. And now we just got to get the body parts to do this. Now, to get that, you are going to need uh, to do some crafting. You're going to need to craft some skin. And to do that, you are going to need this sewing wheel thing. Uh, let's pop that next to it, round right about here. Now that's not too hard to craft. It's it's fairly fairly straightforward. I probably should have. I'll show you. I'll show you it. Uh, where's where we where we at? Where we at with this? Here we go. And a great great. Of course, a loud motorbike has to go past outside. Okay, yeah, just like this. 
Uh, you've already seen that. Yeah, fairly simple. Not too complicated at all. You guys can do it. I believe in you. So, to do all that, to craft this skin, you're going to need the leather, you're going to need some string, and you're going to need some needles. So, you're going to go over here, you're going to pop it over here, and you're going to slap the needles in here, you can slap that in there, and that is going to give you, one of these is going to give you eight skin. So, there we go. Booyah! We got a lot of skin now. Okay, so we'll leave those needles in there, so that's how you get the skin. I've already said to get these brains and the heart and the lungs, uh, you are going to need to just go around and kill the mobs. They're going to drop them like we've got a set of lungs already. So it's just fairly simple. Just go around and killing random mobs, which we all love to do anyway. Uh, but these crafting recipes are how to make the different body parts. So this is how to make the head. This is how to make the torso. This is how to make the arms. This is how to make the legs. And to these little gaps, you're wondering what those are, you are going to fill those with mob parts. So for a creeper, it's going to be gunpowder. Uh, zombie, it's going to be rotten flesh. So you're going to, uh, for, for a cow, I think it's, it's leather in here. But it's the different recipes like that. So that, just that slot for each one will just get replaced by the specific mob you wish to get the body part for. As you see, uh, where do they go? Here. To get all the different body parts so you can use spider eyes for some it's it's not too complicated it's fairly fairly simple crafting recipes which is great so you're gonna do all that you're just gonna put it in a crafter table and it's gonna give you all the different stuff like all of these body parts now let's get on to what we really want to see we want to see some crazy mob combos so what are we thinking first i want to go for like something super duper weird and bizarre and then try to make something super strong today as well so let's go for weird and bizarre first i'm thinking oh what what do i do i want to uh, let's go for a chicken torso with a wolf head uh and let's go for let's go for spy cave spider legs and let's go for chick do we want chicken arms or do we want skeleton arms oh i don't know uh let's go for cow arms so let's get out another oh no we've got, only got one cow arm no uh let's get stuff it we'll get an enderman arm here okay let's go over here and let's pop them in here so you're just going to slap them into position here we go, popping them all in here, yep, yep, there you go, and now you can see it's sort of like coming into form on the table, I've got my shader on so it's a bit weird, but you just gotta right click on this, and it spawns it in, oh my goodness, what the hell are you, that is not healthy, how much health do you actually have though, you got 100, you are actually quite tough, uh, damn, damn, okay, fair play bro, fair play, Let's change the game mode. I want to see if I can get out my mob battle stick. I want to see if I can get these guys to like fight each other. Okay, so they will fight for you against other mobs, which is sick. So we'll get this guy and we'll see if we can get him to fight. Come on, come on, go ahead. Yes. Oh, look at that attack. Look at that Enderman arm. Look at that Enderman arm. It's mental. Just waving it around. This is crazy. These mobs are sick. All right, come on, come on. Yeah, you are a strong dude. Damn. All right, what else can we get out? I want you guys to comment down below what other weird and wonderful combinations you think we can craft. I really want to know your guys' suggestions, and if we get enough, I'll come back and I'll do another episode on this, because that would be awesome, I think. So let's go for some zombie pigment arms, uh, and let's go for some creeper legs. This would be sick. Okay, this is gonna uh, this is gonna be a cool combo. This is gonna be a cool combination. All right, let's get this out. Let's get this out. Let's put these here. Yep, yep. All right. Okay, nice. Okay, boom. Oh, dude, dude's not doesn't have as much health as this guy. This guy's well strong. I don't know why that guy's so strong. Oh, look at his face. Look at his face. It's creepy. Oh, get get off get off the platform, bro. Go on, go go for a little wonder. He looks awesome. That looks absolutely sick. I love this one. This is, this is my favorite one so far. So what else can we do? What's going to be super strong? It's going to definitely be an iron torso. Uh, what's the ultimate mob combination? Uh, Enderman head? 
Enderman head's got to be up there. Uh, probably Witch's arms, because they do the potion throwy stuff. And then let's go for spider legs, because then they can climb up a wall. That'll be a cool combination. So let's take these out now. Let's put our new combos in. All right, this is going to be a mad combo. This is this has got to be a strong one. This honestly has got to be a super strong one. Okay, how how? Oh, oh damn! Look how strong that dude is. Dude, 170 HP. That is a sick one. I don't know if he can teleport with these abilities or not. If like he inherits some of the abilities, because that'd be sick if he can. Look at these guys all following me around. Okay, you stay. You stay. Uh, I want to get a iron golem out and spawn that in and see him fight it okay here we go let's do this things okay now attack now attack oh look he's going for him he's got oh seven h seven hp of damage that isn't too shabby my goodness the iron golem is having a bit of a nightmare though i'll tell you that he's not really able to take madu down madu too quick he is smashing this this has to be like the strongest combo Honestly, if you guys think you can come up with a stronger combination, let me know and we'll definitely come back and redo this mod because it is amazing. All right, so let's get out one more. Let's do one more combination today. Let's do that. Okay, so let's get uh, that head out. Let's go for... Uh, oh, do we, let's go for a spider torso. Uh, let's go... No, no, stuff it. I want to go Enderman torso. And... Oh, are oh, the options... The options Iron Golem arm has to be done. And then let's go for the legs of uh, a cow? A cow legs. Let's go for cow legs. Oh, this would be cool. This is going to be a weird one. Uh, also, if the mobs have rideable bodies, like the cows, pigs, uh, spiders, well, you can actually ride them. You can slap saddles on them and stuff, just as a quick side note. Uh, yeah, but we're not going to do that today because that's not super duper interesting like this. Okay, this combination. I've got a, I've got a good feeling about this one. Come on, come on. Oh my gosh. Okay, get off. Oh, that's weird. The arms are longer than the legs. Bro. I think you can like see his teeth and everything as well. That's sick. My goodness. Yeah, go go wreak some havoc and do some random stuff. But there we go, guys. That is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this. Because it is sick. Look at all my little pets. Oh my goodness. I want to keep these permanently with me. They're great protection. I love them. But yeah, guys. I want to hear your suggestions. Then we'll come back and we'll do more on this mod. Because it's super cool. Super fun. But anyway, guys. Till next time. See ya.